Good morning. Welcome back to the vlog. It's Friday and it rained all week and today is the first day of like beautiful blue skies, kind of feels like spring. And this weekend is actually daylight saving. So I don't know, this is like such a turning point obviously and it feels really good to be getting towards like longer days, warmer nights, not warmer nights, warmer, whatever, you know what I'm saying. I have a couple packages that I wanna open with you and also I got that camera. If you remember a few vlogs back, I was calling B&H about the, uh, the Fuji X100V camera, so that came, but I haven't tried it out yet because it's been raining all week, so maybe I'll do that today, but. Okay, so this is not camera related, and also, I think I've been doing too much camera and I kind of acknowledge that. It's just because I'm new to this content creator life and I've just been acquiring so much content creator, creator tech, like cameras and things, so I promise that's not the vibe of the vlog. But I do think that this Fuji camera is actually way more consumer versus like creator. And there's a lot of, it went viral on TikTok with many people who are not creators. They just like photography and the vibe that this camera gets. Anyway, from Amazon, I am obsessed with like candy. I, don't, I was gonna try to say it in a different way. I'm obsessed with candy, but obviously candy has adverse effects. So I just have to get these smart sweets. I don't know what to say. I have to get these so that I don't gain 100 pounds and rot my teeth out. So I got some smart sweets and they're really, really expensive. Like it's so stupid. Like I think this whole, these, like these boxes are like 40 bucks. But I have one new and improved. I wonder if they changed the texture. I don't love the texture. I got the peach rings, which tastes like peach rings and I got these like Sour Buddies and those are like the uh, Sour Patch Kids. Listen, these are not, you don't crave these and you're like, oh, these are way better than the, the real thing. No, they're not. But they hit the spot for me. They totally hit the spot. In this box, am I able to open this? Yes. If you remember in the last vlog, I talked about those jeans that I got from AYR, not sponsored. I got them in I got them in two other colors and but let me tell you wearing those the lighter jean color that I wore in the last vlog I'll grab them in a second. I'm going to try these on for you. The I don't know if they like they kind of already stretching out and I feel like I should maybe size down on the waist. So I got an even lighter style doesn't look that much different. Let me get the ones that I have. Yeah. This is the pair that I already bought and, okay. These, yeah, you can definitely tell these are lighter. So now it's this pair, definitely different. Yeah, I think this is a good, like this is like, the one that I have now is like blue jean, classic blue jean. And this is like, Oh, just a light wash, a nice light wash, but still like a blue jean. And then I got a faded black. I think what I love about these jeans, obviously the fit, I love the, the fit, but they're really soft. This is a nice. Yeah, it's like you can even see the fading here. It's just not very, very black which I like. I mean, you don't even need another pair of jeans. I mean, this is like, what else would you need? They sell like a creamy white too, which I'm kind of interested in. Just, I have a lot of white jeans, but I feel like the fit, it just makes a difference. Also, just a second here to say, one, I'm sorry what I look like. This is very much morning vibes. I haven't showered, I haven't done my hair. I'm either not gonna vlog or I'm gonna pick up the camera and vlog when I feel like vlogging and um, I'm not gonna always look my best, so I think you get it. What do you look like right now? Just kidding. Also, if you're not subscribed, please take the time right now to hit the subscribe button. It really helps out the channel. Even if you're watching every single week, I see you. I see that people are, are watching and not subscribed. It's like something like 70% of the viewers that come back every week are not subscribed, so if you are one of those people, maybe consider subscribing. I post vlogs every single week. I'm trying to stick to a Wednesday and Sunday upload schedule, but I'm not, I'm not uh, 
I'm not 100% there yet mentally, but I've kind of been doing that anyway, at least Wednesdays for sure. So please take the time to subscribe. It really means a lot and it gives me the encouragement to keep posting. So I really appreciate that. While we're trying stuff on, I wanted to show you guys some of the stuff that Cuts sent me. Cuts is a lifestyle activewear brand and it's kind of like the cross between athleisure and performance wear and I have never checked them out before but they, I've seen their ads and I was always kind of just like, I don't know, it just, I, I never pulled the trigger. So I was really excited when they reached out to work with me because I've always wanted to try it. And they sent me a lot of stuff to check out and I'm obsessed. It all comes pre-shrunk, which is incredible because my biggest pet peeve with these sort of like athleisure brands is that they shrink and that you can't, you can't, you know, achieve the fit that you want when you first try it on because they shrink. So I love that it comes pre-shrink, shrunk, and I love how soft it is. And sometimes you just want to feel like tight and put together while you're in your sort of like comfiness. Like you don't want to feel baggy sweats or something like that. You kind of just like want to run your errands or go to the gym or work from home and just feeling like a little more put together. So here's all the stuff that they sent me. I'm wearing right now, this is the AO curved hem tee, just for reference in terms of my sizing, I'm a large and everything. And I find that it is a slimmer, more trim fit, but that's like, that's what I'm going for right now. Like I, I want to have this like put together, I don't know, I don't know how else to call it, like tight. Like you're just like, you're, you're, uh, does that make sense? I think I think that makes sense. So I got the AO Curve Hem shirt in uh, this beautiful sage color. I love like a greeny gray kind of color and that's what this is. And it's very soft, very soft. And then I got it in black too. And then I'm wearing the joggers now. The These are the AO joggers in black. And then I also got the joggers in this color, which is Canyon. And it's, it's kind of like a nice brown, color without being like overly brown. It's like a beigey brown. It's, it's really nice. They are, they have an elastic. Sometimes joggers, it's, they're not, they don't have like the flex to it. So I love that these do have a little bit of that elastic in it. So it's a little forgiving, you know, you had a big lunch, whatever it is. They have five pockets. Yeah. Two, you know, the front pockets, the back pockets, and then that, that, that little like kind of like accessory pocket for whatever you want to put in there. So really into these. I like the fit a lot. You know, it's a jogger. They're, they're a tighter fit. And then I got the hoodie as well. And I got a crew neck. This is like the ice color. This crew neck is cool because it's got like the, the split hem on the bottom. So it's a little bit boxier in terms of the fit. I like it just like different than a hoodie. And sometimes you just want a crew neck, you know, but this is really soft. Like that's what I'll say. It's all really soft. And I love that it's pre-shrunk. Thank you again to Cuts for sponsoring this video. If you guys wanna check them out, I'll have everything in the description below, including a link and a promo code for you to use. I got this camera finally. This is the Fuji X100VI. This is the predecessor, predecessor? Is that what that means when it's like the next one? Then the, uh, the follow-up to the wildly popular X100V. And what makes this camera really special is the film recipes. What that means is Fuji was well known for creating film and film cameras. So they know exactly how that film looks, that, you know, like that film kind of grainy look to your phot photography. So they actually have, it's more than a filter. It's way more than a filter because it's so customizable. You can choose the amount of grain, you can choose the type of film recipe that you want, the type of development that you wanna, you know, uh, look that you might wanna achieve on it. So I have to fully test this out, but I've done a few photos just around the apartment. Again, it's been dark all week, it's been raining, so I haven't really been able to fully test this out, but it's really cool. And I like that this like vet retro vibe of it. It's got the, the silver and black, which I specifically wanted. They also make it all black if this isn't your thing, but uh, I really, really have, I'm excited to try this out. Yeah, I'll, I'll show you guys what we do.